Democrats. House Democrats still appear to be short of the 216 votes they need to pass health care legislation. But Health Secretary Kathleen Sebelius says she's confident they'll get them. Good evening. President Obama's health care reform bill is top of mind in D.C. and across the country, with an upcoming vote of which the outcome is uncertain. The President and House Speaker Nancy Pelosi are trying to woo wavering Democrats whose votes are needed to pass the historic legislation. House Republicans who have pledged to block legislation are expected to announce a plan to force a vote this week to require an up or down vote on the Senate version of the health care bill. Laura Becker reports. The classic game of Republicans versus Democrats on Capitol Hill regarding health care reform. Whether it's the actual legislation or politics at the root of why the GOP is not favoring the bill is debatable. But it seems the public is just as divided as the House. We need a bill after from all these years. We've been trying to pass that for like 30, 40 some years. You know, I think we need one to have one pretty quick here now. Everybody needs one. We don't need to spend all that money. There are better ways. President Obama plans to be present in the House for the vote, delaying his trip to Indonesia, Australia, and Guam. Obama's top advisor, David Axelrod, says the president is absolutely confident that the legislation will pass when the decision is made, possibly this Friday or Saturday. The administration claims with backing from new supporters, his chances have improved. The American Association of Retired Persons supports this, this piece of legislation. The American Medical Association supports this piece of legislation. Those are two huge, powerful interest groups that have always been in opposition to health care reform in the past. To see that those groups have, have kind of joined on and support this is a huge accomplishment for the... Pundits say passing this bill could have a positive effect on Obama's negative approval rating if he is able to check this big-ticket item from his to-do list and begin focusing on new priorities. In Lima, Laura Becker, Your News Now. Thank you, Laura. White House aides say President Barack Obama plans at least one more public health care event this week. Obama already plans to speak in Virginia on Friday.